Hello and greetings from London, England. I've been here for about a week at a DJ conference. How's everybody doing today? Yeah! You guys make us feel so welcome here every year, year after year. I'm Brian Ren. Thank you for coming. And when you're on the road, it's hard to eat right sometimes, and I don't think I ate right this time. I did try, though, but I'm feeling a little under the weather, and I can't wait to get home and cook my own food. Can't help but think about Cookie. Hope she's eating right. Hope Mommy's not giving her too many table scraps. Hope she's on her peptonics diet and treats. It's going to be the best thing for her. When I get home, I'm going to find out, because I'm going to check her and see how she's doing. Make sure she's not getting bigger. Hopefully, she got smaller while I was gone. You know, she's doing real good. I feel better. You know, she's not any smaller, but the good news is she's not any bigger either. We've stuck to our diet. In fact, I made steaks when I came home, and she didn't even want any steak fat. She didn't beg for it. I think she's used to her new food. Now, one thing about the food, we've got this uh, grain-free food, which we're using, but it's lamb meal recipe. It's a little different than what we had last time. We had chicken, but she likes it real well. See? She likes it. She's sipping the bag. She wants some, but she already ate. But I'll give her another treat for being a good girl. And these are grain-free as well, all the Omega treats. But you know, they talk about gluten allergies. You've heard about gluten stuff? I think maybe it's the same thing with dogs. Maybe some dogs just don't need that. I don't think anybody really needs it. It's not really good for you, but grain-free is good. It doesn't make us any larger. But you know, she still is kind of the size of a coffee table. Somebody commented that she's a coffee table with teeth and a tail. And I think they're probably right. But I think you're just big-boned. You're not fat. I can see you actually have some curves to you now. You used to be just kind of a big bag of potatoes, but you don't look like that anymore, do you? So we know most of it's not exercise because we don't get a lot of that, but I'm betting it's definitely her diet. Now next time we're going to give Cookie a break. We're going to go out to my mom and dad's house and visit their dog. He's pretty cool. He's a rescue dog. He's a little Boston Terrier. And let's see if he goes as crazy over these pet botanics treats as Cookie does, as you can see, she's driving me nuts. I've got one in my hand, and I think she wants it. So there you have it. We'll see you next time. And if your dog is eating pet botanics too, let us know how they like it. We'll see you next time, and take care of your pet.